Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today I wanted to do a quick and snappy AliExpress nail art supplies haul because I bought a ton and when I say a ton, it really is a ton of um, gel polish. They're all coming in like really tiny, uh, let me just grab one real quick, really tiny little pots and I got them all from the store, let me check. The uh, v3 store it is called these are all soak off gels i've got the pure color ones as well as some really pretty glitter ones but let me just show you what the box look like that i got it is insane so i got a bunch of different stuff like a ton of these little pots of gel with color and glitter but i got some flaky polishes as well and some tools and just a lot of different stuff. So if you want to know what I got and where I got them, just keep on watching. So let me just grab this big ass thing and get it out of the way. Because I want to start off with some different things first before I go into the little, uh, the little pots. Because I am going to do um, an complete swatch and review video of all of those little um, gel polish or gel color pots that I got and I think I have about 50 to 55 pots or something like that I ordered a ton because they were really affordable and yeah I'm not going to dwell on those too much but I did get from let me check I got a bunch and it's just laying all over the place I got from the store called Fabian VIP store. I hope I pronounce this correctly because I'm not sure. Fabian, it could also be like that, but it's a gel brush set and it is a five piece set and I got it for only 89 cents. So there are some different sized brushes in here and I just bought these because I felt like these would be great to use to apply these little gel color pots with. And yeah, it's really affordable. The handles are decently long. They're not like super short or anything like that. So they are easy to work with. And then let me check. I did get some stuff from the Elwing Secret Store as well. Because in my um, last or my previous gel haul uh, of stuff I got from AliExpress. I got like lots of comments um, asking me why I wouldn't buy the Vinalisa or the Kenny or Kani uh, brand. But all the stuff I got in my previous haul are just to make embellishments with. So I won't be applying those um, near skin or onto natural nails directly. I'm just going to use them on top of an already like Europe approved gel polish, if you know what I mean. But um, I did get some other stuff from that store. So it's from the Elwing Secret Store. And that is this, um, I don't even know how to pronounce this. A Afer gel. It's just um, a rhinestone glue. And I haven't opened this yet, but it is sealed pretty nicely. And I really like that because, yeah. I've had some spillage in a previous order and stuff was just all over the place and I really didn't like that. So big plus to them for sending out this one so perfectly. So it is a decent amount in here. I don't know if I can see how much is in here, but if you want to know any links or anything like that, just let me know in the comments down below and I will look them up for you and reply to you directly. Then I also got a dual ended tool and this one has a little gel brush or like a carving gel brush on one end and on the other side I got a little spatula so I can get out all of the carving gels. Oh and by the way um, this little glue thingy I don't know if I mentioned but it cost me about a euro. And this dual ended brush slash spatula cost me two euros and 90 cents. And I really like the color, so it looks really pretty with that fade. Really nice. Then let me just grab all of the stuff I have left, which is all from that V3 store I mentioned earlier in this video. So I did get four um, peacock gels, which are like... 
um, flaky kind of gel polishes and they all came packaged in these like foamy things really sturdy though i was really really happy to see that it came packed that way because sometimes when you buy stuff from aliexpress um it goes everywhere and it's just thrown in a big ass envelope and you're not really sure if it will survive like transport you know but i got four of these so i got four different ones and this one is 725 and all of these were 2 euro 79 so below three euros and there is almost eight milliliters in here but these are like beautiful flaky polishes or like gel polishes and I think I'm going to swatch these, make a separate videos uh, of these swatching them on top of black because they look super stunning on black. So that is the first one. It is more of like, um, it has purple, blue, it won't focus, but oh well. <laughs> It's really beautiful, like peacocky. Um, this one is kind of similar. It is 722, but I feel like this one has more of like green in it. It really shows the color really nicely when it's out of focus though. <laughs> and I do feel like the brush and the cap is a decent size. It's not too big, but it isn't like tiny either. So it's still pretty handy um, to use. Then I've got two ones which are more of like a purpley blue and this is just like a mixed one. So let's continue with this purpley blue first and that one is 723. There were six colors in total to choose from though, but the other two were kind of like dark and blackish. I might order them later on, but I'm not sure yet. I'm going to try these out first. Um, this is more of like a blue purple really pretty let's just get it out of focus so i can show you the colors better <laughs> it's really really pretty though especially on top of dark colors they really pop really beautiful and then this last one is 726 and this one really is a multicolored. i see lots of purple in there but also some green and it almost looks like holographic it's just a little rainbow glitter in a pot, if you know what I mean. Or in like a little bottle. And I do like the bottle too, though. They seem black, but when the light hits it, it's kind of like a really dark brown. And it reminds me of like those pharmaceutical little glass jars, which they had like back in the day. But yeah, these are the four I got. I might get the other two just to make it like a full collection review slash swatch video later on. So do let me know in the comments down below if you would like to see me swatch these and if I should get the other two as well. But let's just get these out of the way and then it is time to show you all of the different pots I got of the gel polish colors and glitters. There are so much, it is insane. But they were only... Um, 48 cents oh and if you hear my cat like mowing in the background that is because i am recording this video in my living room because my husband is upstairs and he's still sleeping and i didn't want to wake him up because my beauty room or like my um uh studio <laughs> is kind of close to the bedroom so i don't want to wake him up by talking so yeah but let's just continue with all the stuff i got so oh there's a cat tail. <laughs> I did order this in like two different sections. So the first time um, I ordered about 10 different colors and glitters in total. And then, oh, there's my cat again. <laughs> and the second time I ordered about 45 to 50 different ones. So I just wanted to order a couple of them first just to try it out to see if I like the seller how it's packed all of that jazz before I would actually order like a bigger amount of items and as well money um, but still the second order was really affordable I paid about 20 euros I think for about 45 to 50 colors which is super affordable I know the pots are slight uh, slightly like small just this is one of them i think there's about five 
uh, maybe six milliliters in here but that's okay i got lots and lots of colors and i do think i'm going to use these for like nail art and stuff with really finely like liner brushes so you don't need much product anyway of these gels i got for 48 cents in euros each as well as the glitter ones i got i haven't opened any of these yet but i will when i'm going to um, swatch all of these colors separately on little swatch nails so the first couple i got were these so i just wanted to try out a few and let me just see if i can get it in frame nicely so i got seven colored ones and they only have numbers on the top but that's okay with me that's totally fine and um, it does say if it is a color gel or it is a glitter powder gel i don't know why it is like a glitter powder because glitter usually is kind of powdery so that's kind of like an extra word they really didn't have to add <laughs> on the sticker but on the stickers you can actually see what is inside so that's really nice so i started with a black and a white then i've got a really burgundy red i was really into the fall colors when i ordered this first uh, little bunch and this is a beautiful like bright purple then i got a dark blue as well because i really love blues and it's just pretty and this is like a really nice grayish sky blue color and a really lovely like dark green i don't know if you can see it is a dark green it seems to come across a little bit as a black or something but it is a dark green and i'll just show you how they look so you just screw off the cap and they are completely sealed so you just have to peel this off a little bit um I'm just going to do that with tweezers later on. So yeah, let me just grab all the other colors and just show you all of them real quickly because I am going to do a swatch and review video separately, swatching all of these colors as I said before. I'm just going to show you all of the colored ones first. And there are a lot, it is insane. I just couldn't pick just a couple. I wanted a lot. Because, yeah, if you have the option to get a ton, I feel like you should <laughs> get a ton. So let's just start with these real quick first. So 612 is a really nice bright blue. Then a little bit more of like a softer one with a little bit of purple. This is like a beautiful teal. It looks a lot darker on camera. But I'm not sure how they will look on the nail anyway if they are true to color as the sticker shows. Because this seems black on camera but it actually is a dark purple. Then I have some really bright green. A little bit more of like a minty color. Then some other greens. This is like a toxic like lime green. And this is more of like a soft pastel -y. Then a bright yellow and this is kind of like a bluish green with a grey undertone. Mm. These are some purples. And this might seem like a lot but I didn't even get all of the colors they had available. <laughs> I just picked the ones I really really think look pretty. These are some pinks. Some more pinks. This is like a really berry kind of purpley pink. And these is, uh, are like a really nice burgundy reddish purple. And this is like a salmony peach tone. And all of the other shades I got are glitter. So these are the final colored ones. So I did get some neutrals though. This is like a really light gray and these are just really pretty nude shades. Then these are pretty neutral too. This is a little bit more of a darker, not really a brown though. I don't know how to call this color. And this is like a gray with a hint of green. Then I have got 
the shades which are more towards the orangey kind of salmony tone and a little bit of like a sun orangey yellow color then this orange i think it's super bright and this is like a soft red then another blue <laughs> And these are some purples. And again, these are all sealed really, really nicely. I haven't had any spills or like leakage or anything like that. I actually checked them before I put them all in my little pink box, which I just stored them in real quickly. Um, they're all sealed really nicely. And yeah, I just, I haven't had any negative experience with the V store yet or this brand of gels but i haven't tried them out like on the nails yet so um this is the last a really soft dusty rose kind of pink then um let me check these are all of the glitters i got in my second batch <laughs> so i've got some really nice silvery kind of glitter ones this is like a really sparse one, I think, with like bigger, chunky glitter. Then these two, really pretty. This is kind of like a fairy dust, or at least it looks like it. Then I've got some brighter ones as well, some yellows. I've got a gold. I don't even know what kind of color this is, but it looks like a really finely milled glittery one. I've got a green. Let me just get these out of the way. And then I've got a little like light blue as well. Oh. Some purpley pinks. I think these will be great to do like a glitter gradient or like, like a glitter fade or something. And these are like pinky with golds. But yeah, there were all the items i got i'm sorry this is like such a long video after all and i just wanted to make it a quick and snappy one but you know stuff happens but if you want to have any direct links do let me know in the comments down below and i will get right back into that if you want to see me do any swatches or like separate review videos um just let me know in the comments down below as well i am going to swatch all of these little pots i got and i might get the other two of like those peacock um flaky kind of gel polishes as well so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys in a next video